we've just got to zoom out here and take in this insane marble run. Hello everybody, Mr. Sixman here, and welcome back to Marble World. In today's video, we've got another ridiculous marble run to play with, and this one is seriously big. It's got cannons, spinners, funnels, loops, bombs, and 3.6 million escalators. Basically, it's the perfect opportunity to make some massive traffic jams. Link in the description below if you want to have a go with it. Oh yes, this marble run is huge. And over here, look, we've got 720 marbles waiting to go down the track. So let's put those barriers down and follow them on their way around this thing. And uh, don't worry, we are going to put loads more marbles in in a minute. In fact, let's just put another group down there, look. Now over 1,400 marbles. They're rushing around these corners super fast. And uh, eventually, look, there's a big traffic jam down here where they're trying to get onto this escalator. But there's so many of them that a lot of them are falling off and going down this route instead. And uh, there's a big traffic jam over there as well. But a lot of them are going up this really bizarre escalator, which is actually diagonally angled upwards. Um, <laughs> sort of, it's quite strange, isn't it? But really interesting to look at. And those marbles are dropping onto these holes here. Some of them falling into the funnel down below and ending up down here where those other ones went. But the other ones are actually going past the holes and ending upside down, then jumping back onto this track up above, around the corners, and eventually going into this funnel here. Um, and they're all meeting together at this point, because this escalator down here, which we saw a bit earlier with the traffic jam, that's also going up there as well. Look at, <laughs> they're sort of spinning around here like a big roller, aren't they? As they try to get onto that escalator as fast as they can. The whole thing is loaded with marbles. And uh, let's go around here and see what happens next. I'm going to turn the sound down because it's crazy. There's, look at the, listen to the noise in this funnel, guys. <laughs> it's mad, isn't it? So uh, that's why I'm turning the sound down a little bit here. Now look in this funnel. They're gonna go through the spinner. Let's follow them down through the spinner and see where they end up. In a pipe at the moment, I think. Here's the pipe they're in. Let's go back inside it, rush up to the top and try and catch up with all the other marbles which have gone through already through a checkpoint down a really steep ramp there and into this noisy bowl which we saw a minute ago loads of bumpers and things which flash and you know make this noise every time a marble hits them let's go through here and keep on following them as quickly as we can uh those are bounce pads in between this sort of snaking s-shaped track they go around the corners boost the pads and then onto another escalator oh yes that's the big stack look up here there's just tons of marbles on this thing a stack of one two three four uh, five escalators here and this is actually the tallest part in the whole marble run check this out if we just go over here you can see that this is the highest part in the whole run and it's nearly touching the ceiling let's go over here they're going to come around the corner and drop onto a lovely sort of set of spirals here a couple of those it's really quite nice to watch isn't it i could just watch that all day to be honest they're going around so quickly up the top i wonder if any of them are actually falling off it looks like they're being sort of controlled by this booster pad anyway. Dropping onto the top, down the spiral, then onto a second spiral, just offset from the first one. I really like how that transitions from there, one into the other. It's kind of stepped down here, isn't it? And that's really, really nice to watch there. Let's follow these ones down then. There's a big ramp at the bottom. All of them are going, sort of just jumping down that ramp there, around the corner. Hopefully not too many are falling off. They're pretty well controlled, aren't they, at the moment? A bigger spiral over here. And uh, eventually, there's another ramp, a uh, checkpoint, and a splitter, and a merger track, um, all joining back together. Whoa! Guys, look at the size of that booster pad! <laughs> it's huge! That's one booster pad here. That is enormous! But let's follow them through. They're going to go really quickly through there, surely. Yeah, here we go. Whoa, look how fast they're going. And there's another one here as well, which is actually angled upwards. So they're kind of jumping, look, when they hit that booster pad. They're jumping up in the air. Oh, that one just fell off the track. Let's follow them around here then. And now this is really nice. Check this out. There's kind of like a spiral system, but look at the design on that thing. Isn't it lovely? Another thing I could just watch for hours on end, but let's just go down here. Oh no, we've got a bit of a traffic jam building up on there. Look, only, uh, only four marbles or so. Let's follow them down here. And uh, there's a transparent track now, which is very nice. They're all going onto that and uh, going around the corners over some boxes here on the bedroom floor. And uh, now there's a funnel here. Oh, okay, so some of the marbles are actually hitting the booster pads and ending up on the funnel. 
but the other ones are actually carrying on around. So wait a minute, let's just see where the funnel goes first, and then we'll have a look at the other ones in a minute. The funnel ones are dropping down here, look. Followed them into a pipe around this corner, and then they're jumping down these gaps here. Okay, I like this. So, whoa, look how quickly they're just jumping up that really steep ramp as well. Really fast around the corner. <laughs> Another like four really big booster pads over the bowl that we saw earlier into this funnel and then dropping down onto another booster pad around the corner. And uh, guys, the booster pads in this map are enormous, aren't they? They're going to end up here on this uh, sort of horizontal escalator, which is, oh, that's lovely. I love watching those go on. That's so satisfying. I know we've missed out a better track over there, but don't worry. We will have a look at that shortly as well. We'll just see this first. Let's carry. Oh, look at that. Some of the marbles are actually running along the wall at the top and then dropping back down on the track. There's uh, some sort of mechanical stairs here. The, uh, the staircase which is taking them up to the top. That's another lovely thing to watch. And uh, some S-bends after that. Loads of booster pads making sure they get round there without getting stuck like that red one. Anyway, let's carry on now before we run out of marbles. And uh, they're all going down here. Oh yes, into the loops now. So, oh that's amazing. Check out that big booster pad there by the way. See that in a minute, they're jumping off the top of it. Uh, yes, there's some loops over here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. And look at this, they're working really well, aren't they? That's uh, that's really nice, that is. Okay, so they're all making their way eventually along here. A couple of marbles here, a bit slow. And they just got bashed into there, look. That can cause big problems for loops. If you get any that sort of get slow, uh, yeah, that can cause major traffic jams on these things. But so far, they're working very well, aren't they? Eventually, they all end up here on this escalator or set of escalators, which takes them up a bit higher. So that's what's happening over here, look. And by the way, that's a big teleporter. We'll see what happens with that in a minute. But let, <laughs> let's go over here first. They're going to drop off the escalator around the corner there's a booster ring there look just zooming them around the corner I'm gonna drop down onto this track below and end up at the base of this escalator here it's taking them to the top ah now this is quite nice isn't it because what they do is they go into a single lane track um, oh, <laughs> and then split off into two different directions but uh, it looks like they all come together over here, hit the booster pads, and go onto this escalator. Guys, it, there's just so much in this marble run, isn't there? I can't believe it. It's just amazing. We're not even near the end yet, so let's keep going up the top of this escalator. Um, another single lane track that kind of splits into two, look, just here. And they're going to go around these bends. Let's just zoom out and get a top-down view. That's really awesome. Check that out. I love watching these things from different angles. It makes a big difference, doesn't it, as you just position the camera in different places. But they all end up in this funnel here, look, merging and dropping down that hole. Another thing I could watch for hours, just marbles dropping down these holes. It's so, so cool, isn't it? Right, let's just drop down below nice and slowly around the corner look hitting those booster pads i wonder how many booster pads are actually on this marble run guys have a guess and let me know in the comments but i reckon it's probably like uh, 300 or so <laughs> it's probably more than that actually it's probably about a thousand isn't it some of those marbles are actually jumping into the teleporter look they're jumping through the air off the end of this track really far into that teleporter over there but the other ones are going down this route instead let's see if we can follow some down here most of them are jumping off the track um but some of them seem to go down here look and oh it's they all end up in the kind of same place anyway as you can see that big teleporter down here is actually linked through this blue laser beam up to this teleporter so what happens is any marble that falls into the big one ends up falling out of this little one here um and they eventually end up back on this track dropping through the holes or wait but where do these funnels go okay so that funnel actually drops down here look we'll follow these marbles here and eventually it ends up in the big bowl down there which i'll explain in a minute because that's pretty crazy in there it's got bombs and everything guys there's some cannons here which we're gonna have a look at very shortly as well but there's another track so if the marbles actually avoid the holes they end up going down this track which we saw a minute ago and uh, they just roll down into the bowl as well, actually. So well, there's not many down here now, but, but that's what happens. 
I'm going to have to spawn in a few more marbles, guys, because loads of them are now on the floor and uh, they're stuck and everything. Look, at, if we go over here, look how many are on the carpet, just stuck forever. So I just put tons more in the background and eventually they're going to get over here. And that should be a lot more fun if we get hundreds of marbles just piling into this bowl with the bombs. Right, now there's loads of marbles coming into this big funnel down here. So what's happening is we've got cannons, right? We've got loads of cannons all over in different places and they are blasting bombs, as you can see into the uh, into the funnel down there let's watch this one but uh, <laughs> that's pretty cool isn't it but there's also one on the seats over here and uh, that's working as well firing them up really high and then they're landing in the in the funnel but if we look up look how high that cannon is over there look it's so high in the air and it is blasting bombs down into well just sort of the edge of that funnel and uh, they're landing just down here let's go down here and have a watch here it goes it's gonna explode there and it's amazing isn't it but there's one even higher and it's on the ceiling and that is literally the highest thing in this marble run probably this cannon just firing straight down near the middle onto that booster pad down there let's follow it down there there it goes into near the center it's going to go straight into that spinner i love how the bombs actually get like allocated a space in the spinner <laughs> the marbles are just flying everywhere look how many are coming onto it as well this is amazing isn't it so if they do actually go through the center look they don't go into this big uh, teleporter they're actually if we have a look here look there's a laser beam which goes from this teleporter in the center all of the way uh, oh goodness me, I'm dizzy now. Look how many inputs and outputs there are. It's bad, isn't it? They're going to end up over here on this teleporter. Let's just turn that mode off before my PC blows up. So now they get split up after the teleporter. So you can see them all coming out there. And uh, they're hitting those booster pads. Now I'm sure they probably end up merging together. Yes, in this funnel down here. Okay, so they're going to drop through there. Down onto that track. And wow, they're going really quickly up that ramp, aren't they? around this u-bend and then ah oh, now this is very interesting because I, I like this design we've got these horizontal spinners all in a row and extended out so they're quite wide and <laughs> check that out the marbles are just queuing onto it as fast as they can uh but uh, it's quite interesting isn't it that is quite a nice extra addition to the marble run they eventually end up going off the end and onto another escalator i wonder how many escalators there are oh no it's a marble crusher <laughs> so what's happening is they're going over the top look up here at the top of that escalator and they're actually getting sort of crushed in in between these two big escalators There's another one behind it as well so what they're doing is let's go through shall we Oh my goodness, I'm, I'm really dizzy going through here. Oh no, no, we're going to get crushed. No, what's happening? Oh, we're inside now. Uh, <laughs> oh, 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 here we go, here we go. You can see them going down, look. So we're now in between the escalators. Oh, it, I'm not actually moving, but it feels like we're going down, doesn't it? But, uh, oh, that's really, really quite uh, strange, that feeling. Down at the bottom of the escalator. And let's see, they're dropping down here, look. Okay, onto this big board at the bottom. There we go, we can see them coming out of there. And these booster pads here are lined up to keep them on the board, I think, so they don't fall off. Past the arcade machine in the corner. I wish we could use this thing. It'd be so fun, wouldn't it, if we could press the buttons and do something with it. <laughs> It'd be so cool. Anyway, those ones go around the corner and onto another escalator. Not many marbles around here now, because most of them have fallen onto the floor, I think. But we currently have 1,500 marbles. In a minute, I am going to spawn in like 10,000 marbles, by the way. <laughs> and we'll see if we can, uh, you know, break this thing and cause some big traffic jams. But uh, let's try and get to the end first. So after that escalator, look, they're going around these two tracks here. Up another two escalators. And it looks like we're heading back over to the start line now. So let's follow this pink one here. Um, and by the way, both of those tracks, I think, are going to end up together. Look at the size of that booster pad on that track down there. Is anyone going to go? Yes. We've got a marble coming around. Whoa, it's so fast. Surely there's some more marbles. Yes, the green one is going along that big booster as well. Smashing into the end around the corner. And it goes uh, sort of around a spiral there. There's a jump here as well, which is quite nice. So just coming off that track, look. Here's another one over the top. And uh, eventually, it ends up dropping back down onto the start line here. There is still a track which we haven't actually seen yet, unbelievably. So let's go around the corner here and back around to this section where some of those marbles are going onto the funnel. And that's where we followed them earlier through that pipe over there. But the other ones are actually going past it, look, around the corner here and onto this escalator. So let's follow these ones around and see where they end up. There they go, off the top of the escalator, around the corner at the end, and then back onto another escalator over here. There's a whole track which you haven't even noticed 
and uh, it goes up the top of this funnel as a wedge and uh, they're going to go down into that spinner or a couple of spinners there in opposite directions I think in the centre of it. Let's follow those ones through then and uh, oh that's interesting as well. Another four spinners there in this funnel down below. Let's go through this one into another funnel and oh there's a tube here. Okay so let's follow these ones down. Goodness me. Ah, oh wow, look at that. They're actually hitting a bounce pad. Whoa. These ones are hitting that bounce pad. Look how far they're going. They're bouncing all of the way across the room to the other side and going underneath the chest of drawers here. So, uh, okay, that's going around this corner underneath, then back around again. Oh yes, that's that big booster pad board which we saw earlier. Okay, so let's follow these ones up here then. I'm going to jump off the top look into this funnel. Ah, and that seems to meet up with all the other marbles which came from there earlier. So, yes, they're all going to join back together now. So I think we've seen all of that track now so far. Anyway, I think it's time now to spawn in 10,000 marbles and see if we can break this marble run. Because, uh, you know, 1,500 is nowhere near it. Oh my goodness. Doesn't that look incredible? Look how many... Oh, wow. Okay, let's put some more in. Wait a minute. Where are we? I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> Here we go. Here's the next round. That's three and a half thousand at the moment. We're only a third of the way there, guys. We're, not, we're nowhere near yet. And I will have to use slow motion because um, it's going to get very difficult <laughs> for my computer to survive this. There's a big traffic jam building up here. So let's see if we can break the track in this area. I've just got some more coming in the background. And uh, that is now nearly 5,000 marbles. I've got to leave a bit of a gap here. Otherwise, we are going to probably break it too soon. And we won't be able to, <laughs> be able to do much with 10,000 at that point. This is also going to be a really fun place to make a big traffic jam. Because they're all going to build up here. They're all rushing down. Oh, whoa. Yes, that's it. They're all coming now. Yes, building onto that traffic jam. But this one could be a big problem. Because actually, yeah, it looks like... Well, hang on a minute. Actually... Actually, so many marbles are going on the escalator and onto that track down there. But actually, that traffic jam may not be growing any bigger at the moment. Guys, we've got some serious... Oh, no. We've got a we have got some serious work to do. But uh, <laughs> that is a big problem here because those marbles are not going anywhere apart from that one. Yeah, I think actually we have broken it. Right, 5,500. <laughs> Look at that green marble just bouncing over the top. And as soon as these marbles are out of the way, let's just speed the game up a little bit and get them out of the way. Slow it down again. We've got to put some more in now. So that's uh, 6,200. In a minute, we're going to actually zoom out and just have a look. Oh, there's such a mess. Oh, no. We've made a huge mess in this bedroom, haven't we? Guys, this is going to be amazing. <laughs> 6,800 marbles. And by the way, they are still deleting on the carpet, some of them. So of course, the number is reducing. But uh, we'll try and get as many as we can in here before they all get deleted. So, uh, 7,500 marbles now. We've just got to zoom out here and take in the awesomeness, <laughs> which is this insane marble run. I mean, <laughs> look at the stack of escalators. It's just loaded with marbles all the way up to the... Well, nearly all the way up to the top. More. We're nearly there now. We've got uh, 8,800 marbles. Oh, no, I spawned in... Oh, no. I spawned uh, the new lot in against the old lot. <laughs> That's uh, that's causing some issues, I think. Okay, one more, and that's it. Well, look at them. They're all sort of compressed, and they're all... Oh, they're bursting out the top, because I... <laughs> but that is over 10,000 marbles, everybody. Oh, wow. I mean, it's just amazing to look at, isn't it? Look how many marbles we've got here. Over 10,000, all rushing down here at the same time, round the corners, up the escalators. It's just an explosion of colour. And uh, look at this, <laughs> this big stack of escalators over here is enormous. And the whole thing is loaded with marbles. Bit of a traffic jam going onto this one, though. And I am in the slowest of slow motion in the game right now. You can't go any slower. I think we have broken it because nothing is going to get past this, is it? Unbelievable. That is going to take a long time to clean up. What do you reckon? Is it broken? <laughs> I don't know. It, 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 well, it is. It is broken in place, isn't it? But it is like, it's kind of still working. I mean, uh, all of this stuff is still moving. Even these escalators, they're all working just fine. This is the only... Oh, yes, here we go. Okay. Now, this traffic jam is actually building up to be even bigger than it was before. Yep, it's... Uh... <laughs> this thing is absolutely nuts. Anyway, that's it for today's video, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I can't get over how... <laughs> 
how crazy this looks. Guys, please do hit the subscribe button, the like button, and ring the bell if you want to stay notified of when my upcoming videos release. Until next time, take care, and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye for now.